always on top of here at City Line, but are they real or are they fake? We're going to test your knowledge with Winston Seasbell. <laughs> join us in this because food trends they range the gamut they can be they can sound so crazy that you don't know if it is real or if it is not real so throw it out there and the audience is going to help too they're yeah. going to weigh in I feel like uh, there all, there's always something new that people are working on, and everybody is a foodie nowadays, right? Like, you yes. look on Instagram, and mm -hmm. everybody's posting pics of food. There's always something new. So I've pulled some real food trends, and I have some fake ones in there, and you have to tell me if okay. it's real or fake. All right. Okay, so Sounds this good. is this is the first one. I'm going to describe it first, and I'll tell you what it is, uh -huh. and you guys will tell me real or fake. Okay. So if you are a crust person, so pizza crust, get ready for an unexpected surprise. One bite of this pizza's edge will unleash an oozing cream cheese and fish egg combination in your mouth. Cream cheese and fish egg? Yeah. The pie itself is topped with scallops, crayf crayfish, clams, and shrimp. Seafood. I want this to be fake. I know. Fake. I'm hoping it's fake. You know okay. what, though? Fake. I wouldn't be shocked if it was real. I'm going to go with real. You're going to go with real? Yeah. Most of them are, it's almost mixed. half and half. It's mixed. It's mixed. What is it? Is it fake or real? It is real. <gasps> This is what it I looks don't know how like. Feel about this. Would cream you eat this? cheese pizza and eggs of some sort with fish eggs. Ooh. This comes from one of the major pizza pizza shops in in Hong Kong, actually. So it's a real it's a real seafood inspired pizza. Yeah. Look at yeah. me trying to sugarcoat it and make <laughs> it sound good. You're now. really selling it. Mm, Take yeah. away the cream cheese and I'll Yummy. leave it. Yummy. Okay, let's get to the next food trend. Okay, this is a French <laughs> delicacy. It is a must-have brunch. Uh, goes well with the refreshing mimosa. This is a mm. pickled egg, caper, and anchovy brioche. A pickled egg, caper, and anchovy. I'm yeah, I'm gonna do real too. Real like Most that. of the audience is saying real. Wow. Leanne says real. Okay. What is it? It fake? is fake. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds good. Did you make it up? I did make this one up. You See, had your food. <laughs> He's such a foodie. I know. I heard mimosa too, and I'm like, real. Um, you're such a foodie that that's actually something that could exist. When it'll go into one of my restaurants one day. Who Do knows? that. Who knows? Okay. Put it on the menu. <laughs> the next one. This is a clear, dense jelly called the raindrop cake. It's a gelatinous dessert made with agar, a, subst a substance derived from algae, mm -hmm. where unflavored jelly is used as a vehicle for other flavors like mm. edamame. Edamame milk and syrup and crunchy <laughs> topping. Edamame milk? Yeah. It's called like, a raindrop I feel like cake. it's real. I feel like it's real. I don't ever want to try it. Okay. And the audience says mostly real. Mostly real. So let's say it's real. It's real. This is what it looks like. Edamame milk. <laughs> <laughs> it's a gelatinous ball. <laughs> it's like an eyeball. First of all, from a texture perspective, no. like I can't handle that nope. stuff. I can't handle like jellies. Like I don't, I'm not into that. So wow. Things that you have to slurp. To get oh. It. <laughs> okay, so no, that's real. That is it's real. It's coming to a restaurant near you. Now this one is interesting because mm -hmm. you're a chocolate fan, right? Yes. Okay. So this Bring it on, people baby. love Kit Kats, right? It's a candy yes. bar. Uh, it's got wafer in it. Um, so this is actually a sandwich that includes. Kit Kat, whipped yeah. cream, and some uh, dried orange peel. Oh. Real! Is it real or fake? Minus the orange peel, but okay. real. All right, there's a few fakes in there, but mostly uh, real, and you're yeah. saying real, real, real. Okay, let's take a look. <gasps> real. Yeah. It's delicious. It's delicious. <laughs> I don't know, it might be going too far even for me. It's a Kit Kat sandwich. It kind of like looks like. Level chocolate and carbs <laughs> collide, but maybe not in the best way possible. Maybe not in the best way possible. It doesn't look awful. It looks like it's in an English muffin. <laughs> or like in a, yeah, English muffin or like cocoa bread or something. I love it. Cocoa bread, okay. Bad, maybe, right? maybe I'm back in You're there. You're so easily sold. <laughs> okay, what's okay. the next one? Uh, this is a seafood infused ice cream. Seafood infused oh. sweet cream is cooked until perfection, then stuffed with succulent lobster and served in an oh, oyster shell. It. I think it's real. I like the one woman there who is convinced it is real. Yes, it's real. Yes. Here's the answer. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> I don't want lobster ice cream. No. no. Yeah. Okay, you got any more? Okay, uh, one you more. Trickster? Let's get one more in here. Yeah. This is Polynesian charcuterie. This is where it's at. Succulent roasted pork, cured, smoked, and sliced as an appetizer, taking the world by storm. Polynesian charcuterie. Yeah, that sounds real. That sounds like stuff we have now. Yeah. Well, it is, is that new? It is fake. Oh, it's fake. <laughs> it's fake. <laughs>
I made that Never one up, mind, too. Never mind, then. We don't have that now. I made now. that one up, too. Very good. Uh, give it up for Winston. Those were good ones. <laughs>